NBA overview for last night's game. The Bucks won actually last night. 116 bucks to 100 Bulls. Honestly, a great overall game. The Bucks won the series 4 to 1. Giannis on the Kumba last night, 33 points and 9 rebounds. It seemed overall that the Bucks played a lot better offensively and played some good defense as well, but it seemed like anytime the Bulls got close, the Bucks just went on a run and really couldn't be stopped, especially Giannis. No one really had a problem to really solve Giannis on the defensive side of the ball. I saw a lot of Bulls fans in the comments talking about how if they were fully healthy, that they would probably be winning this series. Honestly, I don't think so. I think the Bucks probably wouldn't want it maybe in six games. That's probably would have been the only change. The Bucks still were pretty support superior on any every side of the ball, really, offensively and defensively. And it really wasn't that close this whole series. And they got the gentleman sweep last night, like I said they were. But what do you think about last night's performance? Honestly, DeMar DeRozan only had like four points at some point in the whole game. Honestly, in my opinion, I feel like he could have scored the ball more. But what do you think? Warriors won last night. The series was 4-1 with the gentleman sweep. Honestly, a great series. 102 Warriors to 98 Nuggets. The Nuggets really fought hard last night to win this game. But they really couldn't get at the end. Steph Curry had 30 points, 5 rebounds, 5 assists, and 5 three-pointers made. Honestly, amazing game, but overall, Jokic had a great game in this series. If you would have had Michael Porter Jr. and Jamal Murray, I think this series would have been a lot closer. It probably would have gone to 7 games, but they honestly won the series last night. Honestly, very unfortunate for the Nuggets in general. Hopefully, they can get more healthy next season, but Jokic was really carrying his team offensively. I feel like a lot of the other role players didn't step up until it was too late and only got one game off of them. But what do you think? NBA playoff predictions for tonight. Honestly, for the Raptors versus the 76ers, this series right now is 3 to 2. Honestly, for the final score, I think the 76ers are going to win 112 to 107. Pelicans versus Suns, I think the Pelicans are going to win tonight's game. That's going to be 3 3 going to game 7. Honestly, I think the final score is going to be really close 102 to 101. The Jazz versus the Mavericks, honestly, this is 3 2 2. Honestly, I think the Mavs are going to win tonight's game. I think the final scores are going to be 109 to 102 Jazz, and the Mavs are going to play a lot better. I think Luka is going to have 30 points tonight, but honestly, it'll be a great game. Eastern Conference semifinals. This is honestly going to be the greatest series in this playoff, really, in my opinion. Celtics versus Bucks. But hopefully, it really lives up to expectations because a lot of people thought that all the Celtics versus the Nets and it ended up in game sweep. So, honestly, I think the Bucks will be a bit better competition, but Chris Middleton, hopefully, he plays somewhere in this series, but I don't know. Honestly, this series is going to be pretty good. A lot of people were making their predictions in the comments. Here's my prediction. I think the Bucks are going to win in seven games. I don't really see it going anywhere before that. I feel like a lot of people were saying Celtics or Bucks in six. Honestly, I think this is going seven games. The final, it's going to be a final game decision.